<clears throat> Hello everybody and welcome to another round of Classic Fixed on the JJ Alt account. We are doing a regular game of Classic Fixed and not as a Grandmaster. So, I am a Grandmaster now, so let's see how this goes. This account at least is. So, I don't know where this will take me in terms of the series, but I do know that I'm going to keep going, so. All right, S for stats, T for territories, C for bonuses. Looks like we go after black, so he might hit my R4 here. Or He'll stay in Africa. He has two choices. Go into South America or stay in Africa. This, this is a huge move for black here. Oh boy. We're both next to each other a bunch. This makes me very worried. Okay. Oh man. Bruh. He doesn't hit me. I think he wants huh. I'm genuinely a little confused, but I know I can get a card out of this right now. Or I could I can't get a card out of these. So I can stay in Africa and try to build on it and let him out. Or I can move into North America and let him move his three. And I think the correct play is to stay here in Africa, even though I can definitely take, I think I actually go North America. And I move this over, cause that's a two. I'm moving that six out. And I just stack on that eight. I think taking North America is better. I feel very confident that taking North America is a better play. Than sticking around in Africa and waiting for them to leave. Because it would take too long to take Africa with the 4 and the 3. If it's just going to take that long, I might as well try for North America, is what I think. But red is looking towards it. It keeps stacking. I know he'll... No. He's looking at, he's looking at Australia. We're good. We're good. Okay. White's got a challenger, so I should get rid of white as soon as possible in North America so he doesn't have a chance. Oh, and white just blocks black. Ooh. I want to get rid of white's three and the one out of North America, so there's no chance at him taking that. Pink could fight me. Ooh, that's not good. Lose the 3v1. Darn it. Hmm. I might have to switch around and take a... Africa, if it... As much as I wanted to go for Africa first turn, I felt like the 4 and the 3 was too much, but since Y just took a card, I mean, it's obviously just not care about Africa. He's gonna move his 9 in, of course. No. 
Wait. He's moving out. Oh, wow. Okay. Now, I'll 100% take that. Yeah. I definitely take this. And I don't care about the two because I'm being generous by moving my five out and him not hitting my five. All right. Okay, I didn't expect, I did not expect that. Mm -hmm. All right. So I want to get my eight out of North America and put it in uh, Siberia or your Tux or over here in Yakutix, any of those spots or Japan, you know, just like that area in Asia. <sighs> oh, yes, yeah, so white's getting hit pretty hard. In the exterior. I guess black changed his mind about Africa or something. I don't know. Or maybe he never changed his mind and he this is what he was doing the whole time and I didn't realize it. So I thought maybe he was going for South America, but he gave that up. Um I think black should get rid of red and white ASAP because those two are fighting or going to be fighting over Australia fairly obviously. Um, and he doesn't want to give them a chance if they have a set on three. Oh. What? I've never pink wasn't in his w the only way I could see that being reasonable is if red was going for Asia or North America and he was just trying to get him out of the way but he didn't face his six towards North America at the top so I'm assuming that he's just hitting because he's going to hit the 5v3. No, he's not. He's just going to hit Black's 1. But he has separate stacks. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, Black's not going to break me, but he's definitely going to protect when he takes that bonus. And I need to get my, if I can get a take out of that. No, I really want that position. Well, I have my eight to get the position from. Yeah, fortify your five up, that's good, well done. So in this position, I need to make that a seven, make this a six, add two to this, take a card on pink's one to get that plus two in the future because I'm not hitting anything else besides a one. Fortify this two up to here to make sevens. Nice. I have the most on the board now. All right, have I lost any? No, it's it's been a good round. People just hitting me, that's how those, I've lost three. I think someone hit a two of mine or something sometime or some I think it was or just a position who knows blue getting his bonus early he cannot protect someone can break I bet red will do it
Red botted? Wait. Did red bot... Did he hit the pink? Eight? Was he a bot when he did that? Because I did not notice. I completely missed that. And white's definitely breaking blue. Yeah. There we go. There we go. And he hits more territory unnecessarily. That wasn't uh, that wasn't necessary at all. White feels super confident about taking his bonus now, and he will. No problems. As long as if blue gets a set on three, a ten set, he could easily hit white. Oh, that would be interesting. Do I have a ten set now that I see this? I don't, but I have a plus two and an eight set. Which is really nice. Hmm. I could give up South America. And go for North America, but I'm definitely thinking that's not going to happen. Since... Red is basically dead. Almost. And white is getting his bonus already. I could give up South America for North America eventually. Just to... What? Why is he hitting white out? Blue's already going to do that. I'm so confused. Why is black still hitting? What is he... Okay, black is bonkers. What the frick? Oh, he thinks he can kill him. And he, that, with that good roll, he can. Holy crap. Okay, and he misses the kill. Oh my god. I have a, a set. Can this make it over there? I bet I could kill both of them. That seven's not unlocked. That seven is. That would take that. That would take that. I think I can get the one. And I think that's worth. I kill pink too. I bet I could have. Too late. All right. Now they don't think I'm trying to do anything with this five by leaving it here because it was an accident, but I do not have a 10 set, but that's okay. I got four cards, so that's a free 10 set this turn. <sighs> Anyone who does not set in is dead, so. Except for blue. Um, I think I definitely still break blue here. He doesn't even protect, so yeah. Black's an easy kill next turn if he does not set in. If he sets in, I can lose my seven. So fortifying that was probably essential. But breaking blue is very, very essential here. And I can't break him from the North Africa. I have to break him from the other, top, other side. Red sets in. Holy. Oh. Oh, he's going to hit pink. And blue. Nice, nice. Oh my god. But he's guarded. Pink is guarded. Ooh. So pink's gonna have to hit a four. Okay. Does he? No, he card skips. Oh. Dude, that makes it even better. Because some. He doesn't have a trade. That, we know he has, doesn't have a trade. 
No, don't hit my seven. Oh, he's gonna do it. Yep. He's gotten really good dice. Unnecessarily good dice for black. What the frick? The kill on pink is ever so much better. I'm forced to trade in. 14. I reckon I just smash blue here. I'm definitely breaking him. But he has a 5 open to me. I think I do still break him. I think... I think I still break him, regardless. Yeah. As much as he's gonna hate me for this, I think that's the right move. That will be definitely worth. Ten set, fifteen. Flip is three. It's about it's still eighteen. So there's, I don't think he hits me. Does he lose the roll? Okay, he hits the four. I think breaking him was the right move though for my game. Just because he already has. Yeah. He keeps going. He won't be able to do anything. He's just opening me up at this point. I have access to him. And I have a set. <laughs> yeah, he's not happy with me, but... That's because I just I just laughed, which is bad. But <laughs> 7v4? Come on. 7v4 if you want to see it. I'm telling you. Ugh. Oh. No, 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 now you're blocking me from the 12. Fortify, fortify something away, like the 6. No, no. Come on, pink, hit the 2. Hit the 2. Star. Still think killing pink is the smart move. Hmm. This is tough. I bet I could kill black. Let's see, I said I get four more troops. That's nine. Nah. I have to hit. I have to hit blue though. I put my 18 out to threaten him. If he hits that, I would definitely still break him. So there's no point, right? Blue can't really do anything about it. And with the set in, it's like, oh. It's gonna be, yeah, he doesn't even take it. <laughs> So I just take another card here, and then I put my whole stack on there, I think. I think I even set in. I'm not, no, no, I don't. He just, oh, he's running. He's going after my 11. All right, this is good. Um, Blue's not happy with me. But red, did, did red just do a 2v1? Holy crap. A bot did a 2v1, that is rare. Pink does nothing still? This is wild. Pink's ever so slightly getting to be more. I 
think I take, I put all my troops on my 11, take a card here and use that at 18. Oh, I'm gonna have it no matter what, so I might as well set in, right, just in case. I want the North Africa with Egypt. No, with this, because that one doesn't matter. Can I kill Blue? He's got 30 troops. I think I can. But killing him would not be worth, right? No. It would not. I think if he doesn't set in here, I kill him. Oh my god. He got the 10 set too. <laughs> 26? Oh, come on. Come come and hit me. Oh, he's gonna kill pink. Alright, I kill... I kill blue now. <laughs> that was not worth... That was not worth it for him. <laughs> oh my god. I just kill blue now. Like, I don't know what was the point of that. I just need to watch out for black... Yeah, he's dead. Like him, yeah, he knows he's dead. <laughs> I just need to watch out for black. I think, I think I win. I think I win this. I need to be careful. Maybe red sets in. That would be bad too. Fortify your six. Ah, oh, darn it. Oh yes, hit the five. Ooh, that helps. Hit the six. Oh my god. Dude, this is very helpful if it does this. No, 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 it misses that. Don't block my, don't block me, no. Mm. Break, 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 that would help. Actually, that helps. Oh, frick, misses the one. I have to go down, hit the one as well. And the black five is still there. Okay. The 22 can take care of all that. I think I have to go through this five to get through this because I need to get rid of black. Because it'll be a 1v1. I need to, oh, obviously I'm killing blue no matter what here. Hmm. Hit the blue one. No. All right. It makes it easier pathing for me. He leaves the, th no. <sighs> I think I have to add two there, the rest here. Yikes. I go through this. Yes, let's go. Yikes. That was a yikes right there. There we go. We're gonna go in a circle here. All right, we got it, we got it. All right. With Congo, Egypt, Brazil. We'll go Brazil, Madagascar, Congo. Okay, 10, we're at 47 troops. Black may or may not be an issue here. Oh, we didn't get that, that's not good. Black could do some serious damage to us. 
Red's gonna break, but Black's only gonna hit us. This is good, getting rid of that, but he's gonna break. Oh boy, yeah. That's bad. Oh boy, that's bad. Um, Killing Red's not gonna be worth it. I think we can only focus on black. Black definitely breaks. Mm-hmm. Opens his 20 though. Okay. He's gonna take as many territories as he can. He's got a 20 blocking. This is bad. This is a bad end game for me. 100% a bad end game. I have only a four set. He also takes the bonus. Okay. <sighs> okay. Egypt. Afghanistan. Afghanistan's where I want it. And I don't need to do that. So good. 15. 20's unlocked this way. He's laughing. I mean, I could lose. I think all I do, because this is China's lock now, is they just take him out of here. I think I also do this. Blue's still watching. <laughs> you put the 19 there, so it's open. But he doesn't want to open me. That's the whole thing of that. That I don't have a 10 set on three. Okay. Black sets before me. I see it's 4v2? No. His five is locked in. That's good. Okay. This is a rough end game. Because if, if he sets before me, that would kill me. Mmm, smart. He's always going to have the Australia, too. This is rough. Hmm. I need to break that bonus. Well, he knows I'm going to hit that. Territory matters a lot. This is a bad. I need to place my troops wisely after this. Nice. Oh boy. He's definitely going to hit my knight if I place him in North Africa. He's going to get like 30. I have more territory, obviously. No, I think I leave it there. Yeah. Bad set. Mm, this is a terrible 2v2. I'm getting the bad set every time. I've only gotten one big set this whole game. Oh boy. Hmm. The bot's gonna hit him next time. Well, he's got four cards, so the bot probably sets in. If he's smart, he can go around and kill the bot. Oh my god, of course, dude. This is just a terrible end game for me. Oh, go for the bot, go for the bot, go for the bot, come on. Oh, uh, oops. Oh my god. I'm oh, Dude, I'm probably going to lose this game. He'll take South America and not open my nine. 
Oh, he's going to hit my nine. And he gets good dice, as always. Holy crap. Okay, I don't think I should set in, but he... I shouldn't be opening up this so that he can hit me. So I think I just take... Well, if I set in, then I just take this without opening the 21. Yeah, I just take it and don't open the 21. Yeah, mm hmm I like this play. Take it, fortify back. I need to hit in one more time. And fortify the five here. He has to do a 6v5 on me. Oh boy, frick, are you kidding? Freaking bot is gonna hit. oh my god, I just need to not break me. Oh no, this is this is crap, dude. This is crap. Mm, it's gonna freaking <sighs> No, no, don't. Don't break me. I need that bonus. Okay, you don't have to keep hitting me. That's good. All right, so the nine's faced at me. I'm going to get fricked from the back. <sighs> In this endgame, you want to hold Australia. Dude, this sucks, man. At least I know he can't break me unless he goes through bread. And that's what I want. He's got a strong, strong lead here. Trying to mess with him. I don't know. He's smart. He's smart enough to leave that there because he knows. Like, I can't. I know I'm going to lose it to red, but if I take it out, he just kills me next turn. Like, if he sets a 10, I'm dead. I think that, oh my god. I think I need to go out here and take that territory. I know I'm losing this. Yeah, I'll go ahead and laugh, whatever. Um, I can't. I have to fortify this guy up to here to create like a a separate place. Yes, yes, it put put it all there. That nine probably won't kill my five then. Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows? Come on, don't kill my five. Don't hit my five, that's all I need. Yeah, leave the twenty one in front of him. Don't hit my five. Yes. Yes. I'll just hit, I'll hit it next turn. Do I have a 10 set? No, of course. Why would I have a 10 set? Why would I ever have a 10 set? Oh my god. Watch him just have a 10 set right here. He wins if he has a 10 set. It's over if he has a 10 set. Like, it's, it's literally coming down to pure RNG now. It, it that's literally all it is is pure all part pure rng at this point like i'm in the war i'm in a terrible scenario because i definitely add to this it's the only position he doesn't have the best access to and i just go up into here Oh my god, if Red has a set, I'm dead. Um, yeah. Black's at 11 anyway, so I didn't attack it. Yes. 
I have a ten set now with the East Africa plus two. Don't hit that black one on North Africa. That's all I need right now. Okay. If I can just get rid of Red's got four cards. Seven's only blocked into that one green place. My three is blocked off. He sets in with the eight. I don't think he can kill me. Oh, it's possible. It's possible. No. Oh, he goes up. Okay. He still can do it. Red still breaks on that North Africa plate. Uh, I have a 10 set, so I can retaliate. That's the best part about it. What is he doing? Oh, he's not splitting. Okay, I thought he was splitting for a second. Okay. So, gonna hit my one, of course. I think red hits the six, but I have to break regardless. Thirteen troops. Maybe I go through red to break him. But then the hype went the five up. I think I use this. Yeah. Sixteen. End with like a five. Yeah, it's not worth. I think I just break here. Fortify it to there. I think I just need to take territory from him. Darn it, I need to fortify that three. Now he has access to it. Yeah, it should hit the AP6. What do I want to see? Yes. AP6, please take it. Yes. Let's go hit his territory. Yes. He has access into there. Wait, I don't. I want to see him hit the red bot here. Probably going to hit me though. No, he's going to hit the red bot. Nice. I don't have to. Okay. Thank you. He has access to my five now. All right. And I can break him. Probably splits twos. No. Gives me access to break. This is good. I am uh, fairly okay with this. All right. I just do this and I go down here. Creating that. And splitting it. Two. No. Split. The three up here, right? Yeah. Put the three there. Block red in case he doesn't. He's going to set in, though. Oh, yes. Uh huh. That's one I want to see. That's great. And I have a set on three with a plus two on the five. Okay. Okay, I could do some serious damage because then he has to come through with the 23. If I can get rid of black from the outside, it makes he, it makes him have to hit red. That's what I need to do. Red, get help me get rid of black. Use your 3v1. Come on. Yes. So I have to get rid of black. As long as he doesn't 10 set here, I think I'm okay. Okay. I'm in a better spot at least. He has to break me. He had a set on three. Oh man. I also have a set on three. Does he break red? I, I hope so. I hope he does. Yes. Yeah. 
So I put it all on the 20. And I think I get rid of him fully. So that he has to go through the 8. Yeah. Because then red will just break. Hopefully, yes, 12, good. Nice. Okay. I think I take this. Yep. Putting it here. <sighs> I think that was the right move. Come on, please don't. Yes, add more. That's great. Holy crap. Don't hit my two. Go for your bonus. Go up with your six. Yes. Don't do the 4v2. Leave your leave my go down with your four at the top left. Come on. Yes. Leaving a territory. Okay. Yes. Oh my god. Oh, this is good. He has to go through a 12. Come on, lose more than you need. Or more than is necessary. Come on. Oh, okay, it's fine. I, this is rough. But at least the 16 is going to maybe break him. Yes, lose three. Oh my gosh. This is going to hurt him a lot. He t probably splits on South America now. But red will break. Most likely. I think I leave this. No, I need to take a card, so I'll just take it here. Leave that three there. Fortify this here, away from red. Oh no, no, that Japan, Japanese or Japan. Oh no, no, that's not good because it might not break black. No, no, it wants the bonus. I am so blind. Oh, that's not good. Because it doesn't break, it doesn't break black. That doesn't, the six, the six needs to do it. No, no, stop hitting me. No, no, no. Oh my God. That, no. No, that, that's not what I thought would happen. Oh my God. Oh, I forgot about North America. Mmm. I forgot that it would just go for the bonus. I'm at five troops. Black is not going to focus me. He's going to focus red, which is good because he won't win the game unless he breaks red here. Yeah, that was. I think that was the play for Black because I think we need to work together at this point. And if we don't, then you get it. I am looking really bad. I think I take a card here and I fortify this here. That one's gone. Like, I need this position, but I know I'm not keeping it. I do not have a set. I think I'm dead if once yeah i think i die because what's gonna happen yeah frick because if it because what's gonna happen since i don't have a set on three uh please blake break black come on don't lose one break him no no dude come on oh my god bro the bot is working for him the bot is working for him bro Oh my god. 
Oh, and he gets good troop. Good freaking dice. Oh my god. Wow. The RNG of this of this player is insane this game. Wow, there's nothing I could do. Absolutely nothing I could do. Holy crap. Black was too strong and it destroyed me. He got really good dice by hitting a 10v9 over over on uh, Central America. Holy crap. That really hurt me. Red, Black should win this game, even though Red has 50 troops. I'm going to sit here and watch as he tries to beat him. You should forward it. Uh, all right. He should have hit Greenland. Because now the bot's just going to hit his four. Oh, a 10 set on three. Oh, boy. That's rough. He's going to get broken. Yeah, he's going to get broken for sure. Mm-hmm. With so much activity going on, I doubt the 4v1 on the right. Yeah, the 4v1 on the right doesn't happen. Yeah, uh, he needs a 10 set now to be able to break. And he should be going through the 9 in Central America and going into Kamkacha to hit that Asia bonus. I don't think he should be doing the 4 uh, Maybe I, I could argue. Yeah, we can argue that Siam's better hit. But I think he should still be doing a lot of damage in North America and here and leaving South America and Africa alone because it's just too open. Good dice. Only loses five on a nine. That's pretty decent. He, his, oh, he should be hitting. Oops. You should be hitting more red. Red. It doesn't matter. Your South America bonus doesn't matter, bro. It, it's going to hit it regardless. Like, you need to go focus on taking territory from red. You out, you're going to outpace him, and that's all you need, dude, is to outpace red. Taking territory is the best thing you could do. And obviously, he's not doing that. Oh, boy. I would not be surprised if red still potentially wins because he did not do take territory. Yeah. Yeah. I mean... I think black can still win, but it's looking real rough. He could lose a roll and it'd be over. Okay. He will win this roll. If he gets bad dice, it's over for him. Oh my gosh. Only loses three. Wow. That, that really helped him. Hits the eight. Huh. He does set before the bot, so. Moving the seven back was smart, yeah. Still, the bot gets eight troops due to territory. 74, 4v1. Yeah, we're going to see that seven before. Fail. That is amazing. A 4v3. Holy moly. We just saw a 4v3. Win. Holy crap. I don't think I've ever seen a 4v3 happen with a bot. That This is expert too. I don't. I can't believe that. Black probably breaks again here. No issues. With a 10 set. Okay. I think at this point in the game, it, it's, it's already in Black's hands. But he was worrying me with all the territory he's letting Red have. He's breaking Red every turn, obviously. But, like, the amount of territory he's letting Red have is ridiculous. Only loses one. Wow. Wow. The RNG is too good for black. 
Like this game, I bet I bet his kill to loss is like double. Oh my god. He's still not taking enough territory. He's letting the bot have so much territory. It's not good. I'm pretty sure the territory is outproducing his bonuses. Let's see, the, the bot's getting 20, 28 territories. How much is how much is that here? Nine. That's six extra troops on territory. The bot's making more than black is. Because he's not taking the territory away from him. The bot's not gonna get that 2v1 though. Oh, oh, that's game changing. Oh frick, that is game changing. Yeah. Yeah, now how you feel? This this is this is oh two three v ones. Oh man. Oh man. I I mean he still breaks red. But oof. Does he does he take his bonus here? Does he take South America? Is he gonna be risky? No, he's not. He's smart enough to just take and break. But it doesn't matter. Red has so much territory. I don't think I don't think black has a chance. Once his once his position in South America is taken away, I think it's over for him. Yeah, see he's getting 10 troops. You got to be hitting territory, bro, and you've not been doing that. It's it's good game. It's oh, you're not winning this. I, I like I'm gonna be honest. It's over. Yeah. Oh my god. Wow. That those are some insane rolls that Red's losing. Why did it? It split on Venezuela. That's an unusual thing I've never seen. When there's no extra territory that's touching? Dude, no, 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 dude. Your game your game's over. Dude, you can't you can't win. In this position, uh -uh. you have to just be lucky at this point, like insanely lucky. Four V three, he probably blitzes it. No. It's over. Like, the game, he really can't win. 11 troops. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. The 9 should be taking out all three of those territories. Black's going to need a 10 set here. He doesn't have it. I, frick. 4v2, probably, if he takes those two, I think it does the 4v2. And if it gets this, Black, Black, you're going to need that 10 set. If you don't have that 10, it's game. If you don't have that 10 set right now, it's game. 100%. Wow. 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 You are saved by the tin set, bro. You are one lucky piece of crap. Wow. And he's going the wrong way. What he should be doing. And he's splitting. Whoa. No, 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 no. What you should be doing is going through... Ukraine here into Southern Europe into North Africa into taking this splitting on Central America and Brazil and ending your turn. Okay. And the four of you one at the top hit the four. Oh my God. You let him get an extra troop. Oh boy. The red player is still going to get his territory bonus 
And he still gets it set. He sets him before black. Doesn't hit the four. Oh, but he's he's really on the four. It doesn't break black. Ooh. That's huge. Black gets a lot of troops this turn. That actually kind of changes the game a bit back. That that 10 trade, that changed the game fairly fast. Without that, I think Black was dead. And he... Oh, wow, I cannot believe this. At least Black is taking territory now. Well played. I think, I think Black has it now if he keeps hitting territory. He should have been doing this earlier. But it's about time he starts taking territory like this. All right. That really helped him. Taking all that territory really helped him. Because now, see, Red's only getting 6 instead of 9 or 10. Oh, he's going to break Australia. And maybe... South America. Ooh. Oh, frick. It probably wipes down there in Australia, which is actually huge. Okay. It doesn't break. No way. But it guards. Oh man. Probably gonna see a 9v7. Oh, he's taking a huge risk. That was not a good idea. Okay. But he's lucky. What, what does it matter if he's lucky, right? What does it matter if he's lucky? <laughs> what does it matter? Oh my. There is no reason for that 2v1. And you don't want to put a 4. There you go. That's actually not a bad idea. You don't want to put a 4 next to troops of the rip bot because it will hit it. If it's breaking a bonus at least, it will hit it. So if you leave it a 1, it's less likely to hit. But I think the bot breaks. Really? It doesn't break. Does it break? North America? Oh, wow! That, I think Black has control of the game now. At this point, I think Black has control of the game. If he t takes territories and breaks? No, don't. You don't want to do that. Okay. You just got lucky, bro. But still, that was not worth... I think you should be taking territory and breaking. At least you still have your... You got the bonuses that turn, but like... Next turn, it's going to break that. Seven troops. We definitely, I think for sure we see this thing break. We, it, it definitely, oh, and it trades in for a 10. Oh, man. It's going to take Asia, split. It could even take Australia. We don't even know. But it's, it's going to split, so I don't think it will do. But it splits. It's going to break the five. Do we see a break on the on North America though? Do we see a break on North America? No. Oh my god. Wow. Jeez. Do we see black have a set? No. It nope, there it is. He just he shows it up at the last minute. Okay. Wow. This game's intense at the end. Like, wow. 
He's going to go for the 74 break. And he's lucky as usual. As usual. But I don't think he's going to break. Uh, he might be able to break Africa. But breaking Asia. Oh no. Oh my god. Only loses one on the five. Dude. What is the Oh, there's the bad dice. <laughs> Where have they been? <laughs> my god. I think red is going to probably take Asia back. Yeah. No, it doesn't. It just takes back Europe. Why it doesn't need not. Uh, it's just okay. Oh, that might have Ooh. Does it break? No, it doesn't. Oh, it's acting like a stacker bot in the bottom. 2v1? No, it doesn't break again. What? This is wild. This is wild. Oh my god, it's letting him hold North America so often. It's going to go with the 11v8 that can lose? Holy crap. But yet he's lucky. Does he get the break? He does. Does he get the North the Europe break? He does by blitzing. Oh my god. Wow. He had the nine over on the right anyway. He knows the eight's gonna get or the nine's gonna get hit, so he's moving it. Is that his reasoning? Probably. No, make it available. Oh. You're definitely getting broken in North America this time. And you're losing Australia. So this is going to be rough. Because now you have to break Asia and Australia. And I think he definitely takes Europe. Does he open up the 9? Does he open up the 9 in Africa? Yes. Maybe? It does. Holy crap. That just helped him a little bit. The 6 gets fortified in front. But he has both bonuses, so I think he's fine. Holy crap. Only 13. 13 is 100% roll on the 7. He should be putting all of it on the 13. An 8v4? Only loses 2. What should I be worried about? He's going to be able to break. He gets Europe. Now he needs to break Asia and Australia. Should be able to get there. All right. At this point, it's guaranteed it's going to break. Yep. And he probably takes it. See the 3v1 at the end. And he gets it. Nice. I think we're at the point where black is going to win this. That and it's just taking longer than it needs to. Oh my god, red set in. <laughs> oh boy. Dude, this game, this ending is crazy. I can tell black is not at the at a very good level, but this bot is making it ever so easy for him. And or it's not, but it isn't. He's just not making the right moves a lot. Like he should be. Um He has he holds three bonuses. This this game's over, for sure. He even has a set eventually before red. Yeah, he got a ten set. Dude, this man, this this player has gotten the 10 set so many times. Like the RNG of it. Like I only got a 10 set once and then two, maybe three, four sets and a three, eight sets and not no once, no six sets. So he knew the nine V four and the 12 V seven. Okay. He hits the four instead of just taking territory to break the bonus. 6v3 risky oh he gets it of course he's a wreck he's a lucky guy what should i be thinking 
Anything else? He should be taking territory right now and hitting that four in Siam. He can get broken in Siam. Probably not going to see it, but he can be. He's protecting North America with that five on Iceland. He most likely will not get broken in South America here. Yep. I think black has won. All right. And if he does this correctly, he should be taking Europe, Africa, and leaving a stack or ending that stack on the Middle East and then fortifying the five to Ukraine. Yep, in the nine four. Oh, he loses five. If he got really good dice, he probably could have killed. Uh, yeah, good move to move the uh, move that out. Eight v eight. Ooh, eight v eight. Imbalance splits, and it wins, and it breaks North America. Ooh, that's interesting. <laughs> that's freaking crazy dice right there that's less than 50% chance but black wins here good game black played pretty pretty well but it is what it is pathing is bad but it is what it is. Alrighty. Well, if you guys enjoyed watching this video, please like and subscribe. I will be uh, posting more of this in the future. If I can win, of course, because I may be losing my Grandmaster status at, for after this game. <laughs> so, alrighty. I'll see you guys later. Peace.